May I ask you a question? Do you think that a, a man like my husband has a chance in a place like this? Depends. A man has to have the proper heart for it. I was partially reared by missionaries. Scots they was. Left when I was 13. Nathaniel! <laughs> I know I'm longer than anyone. And what made them ask you to leave at such a young age? They was killed by Indians. There he was, scrawny 13-year-old, digging graves for his parents. I was raised with the Delaware. But you walk in the world as a white man. I do not live a white man's life or a red man's life. I live my life as I choose. My name's Nathaniel Bumpo. People around here call me Hawkeye. William has been captured by the Huron. And all I ask is to be taken to the perimeter of the French fort. Your husband has been tortured by the Iroquois. Whatever is left of his body, whatever is left of his soul, needs caring for. English cook saw you try to save Elizabeth from enemy warriors. I did not save her. No. An enemy arrow brings you death. Where did he go? To take the arrow for you. I will do it all again for you. The woman, Judith. He spurned her. Nathaniel's gonna die slow, Mrs. Shields. Just like Judith did. Treason. In the heat of battle. Tomorrow he may be facing a death sentence. Would you die for your people? <laughs> yes, I would die to protect my people. Revenge is not your belief. This is different. I miss your father. I was hoping to send your captain to hell, Hawkeye. But I'll settle for you. You are accusing me of murdering that man Devlin. When you hurt people, there's always gonna be somebody willing to return the favor.